What's up, homies? How are you? Let's keep this intro short and sweet. Here are 10 first touch drills that you can do alone. All you're gonna need is a ball and a wall. Enjoy the video and I'll see you at the end. Stay dialed. All right, homies, let's get into this session. First exercise is a right foot open, pull the ball back, open again, play the ball off the wall with the left foot. Really work to open those hips, get them square. It's gonna help you a lot. Same thing here, but we're opening up with the left foot, pulling the ball back, opening them hips up again, playing the ball off the wall with the right foot. As always, working on those angles. Next exercise we get into is the same thing, but as you see, we're playing the ball off the wall with the other foot. So you're opening up with the right, pulling opening again with the left, but playing again with the right foot. Really pull that ball aggressively with the left foot, open, play the ball off the wall with pace. Same thing here, opening up with that left foot, Pulling the ball back aggressively with that right foot, taking an inside touch, setting ourselves up for the next pass and playing it against the wall with the left foot. Next, next exercise is a right foot inside to outside and I know there's gonna be a lot of criticism right away for not looking, but as I always talk about, the most important thing is getting the technique down first, and then we do the look after. So same thing, left foot inside, cushion the ball, take a touch with the outside, pull it back behind the leg, play it off again the wall, play it off the wall again with the left foot, Ricky learn how to speak, and then we can maybe learn how to play some footy. I really love this drill. And then, we go to the look. So as you see, the most important thing, as the ball is coming off the wall, you see I take a look. So I take the inside touch to comfort the ball, to cushion the ball, take the outside touch to drag the defender away and accelerate, and then pull it back. But before the ball is coming to me, I'm checking if someone is on my back. And we go, we do the same thing with the left foot. Harder for me because it's my weaker foot, but we work on it, we do more reps, we take the time to work on it more. That's what it's all about, that's why I'm here, that's why we're training. The key here is really cushioning that ball. And then we're moving on to some pings. Very, very important for every single position is to be able to ping a ball in with pace with the laces of your foot skimming across the ground below knee height. These are excellent balls to break lines, especially if you play in the back line or you play in the midfield. Excellent balls to connect the back line to the front line. And then the last exercise is something similar, but we're using curled pings. So you're curling the ball in, breaking lines, and that's the session. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Homies, thanks so much for tuning into the video. I really appreciate your support. If you like the video, please drop a like. Please drop a comment. Let me know what your favorite exercise was, when you're gonna do this session. And also, please do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, turn on those notification bells. Let your friends, let your family know about my channel. It really helps me out, I really appreciate it. As always, if you have any questions, you know where to reach me. Have a good rest of the day, and we'll talk soon.